He got a virus? Who are you talking with? You're pretty good. So right now we are waiting for the food because actually our boarding time is 9.25 and right now it's <coughs> Now is like 9 11, which is we have this only like a couple minutes to wait. So we thought like we might just grab the food and then just go eat in front of the food. That might be a good idea. So, yeah, when we get through here, um, it's kind of fast, like, it's, it's better than I expect. Like, normally, it would take me like half an hour at least, but today is like 10 or 15 minutes, that's it. Like, it was go so quick. So, yeah. Let's see. <laughs> so really tasty and delicious. <laughs> Welcome to Boston, baby. First time ever. Awesome. So right now we're walking to the back of claim to get our luggage and all of my outfits is there. So excited to wear tomorrow. My baby is coming from that way. Are you gonna grab it for me? Let's go. This guy, don't even get close to him. Like in the beginning when we first date, he gonna do everything for you. But now is day, like I gotta do everything by myself. And now he just like gonna let me carry that all the way to the town. So this is my outfit for today. Um, I have the blesser from outside. And I have the sweater, the turtlenecks. But then inside, I have jeans, which is really comfortable. It's like 90 something years. And then this is my sneaker from Fendi. So all of this I'm gonna put into my body. And then let's see how this look. So look at a Valentine gift that I gave it to him. Stop moving! Stop moving! <laughs> so now where are we going? We are headed to somewhere where I don't know because you didn't tell me. <laughs> I already told people like, it's Acorn Street. Acorn Street. Right. You corn or Acorn? I don't, I don't know. know. So let's see. Now we're waiting for closing the street and go that way. Or this way. So right now we are walking for the Acorn Street, which is like a lot of Instagrammer came here and take a picture. I would love to because I look on the internet, it looks so fancy. And I got one of our guy. She gonna take us to there. She's local. Welcome, Miss Jenny. <laughs> Do you wanna know something? What? How do you get lost? <laughs> really? <laughs> but yesterday, you know what's happened? We were walking like back to her apartment, and then she would say like, "I think I'm lost." <laughs> And like, like one block from her house <laughs> and she was like what the heck uh, now it's like warmer it's freezing this morning i was like oh i'm gonna die
So this is like Acorn Street. That's it's iconic for. So right now we are walking to another street um, to take a picture. I don't think that one is look pretty though in person. On the internet, it's look good, but I think somewhere else might look better. My so friends, she says. Do you guys see it? She says like a lot of people who live here, they're rich people. I should sit down here by myself with a lot of other people. It's gonna look so don't pretend like you are so but yeah for us. So my friend, she just told me like <laughs> then take her into the vlog and she says like she's the most beautiful woman in the world. God, I just got out from the hospital. <laughs> it's the same though. It's freezing. Oh. Oh. I'm like Dying. I, I usually love the weather in the west side more than the east side is always. I know. I used to live in New York before and at that time it was had like a snowstorm which I can't stand and then I just like I'm gonna move back. So I moved to San Francisco and then moved to LA. I still feel like I cannot live here anyways like <laughs> freezing yeah, the winter, uh, yeah like we gotta wear like this look like he had to put a scrub on I have a hat. a hat a scarf I have a sweater and then I have like a heat check underneath that and I'm still freezing right now like like you can hear it in my voice I'm like slurring my words it's so yeah. cold this is crazy right yeah. now like my you see my fingers it's getting so red <laughs> because it's like my fingers are numb oh. inside my gloves right now. Ah. Whoa! Look at our face today. It's just for keep it for a while. You can take the hats off. <laughs> my name. Because, um, because I am. That is my name. I am a nursing student, so he has a bowel movement. <laughs> Bella. <laughs> it's all red. You're gonna One help me. One more thing to tell them. They, they're all way at third wheel. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing a third wheel now. It's so awkward. I'm not a third wheel. Oh, really? I'm a second wheel. Got a little turn so, and right now we are walking to the common, and I want to see the bridge. I have like one bridge, but she says like it's not in. There is probably somewhere else, but it's there, but not there. But the common is over there, but this is another path. <laughs> <laughs> She's like so upset about it. Oh. So because I because I told her like so many times, she said no, is it in there? But like I said no, it's <laughs> you not look at this. Oh no, this is not this. <laughs> I don't know. I'm a low tech. If you if you confusing about this, like which language or which accent that we we have. So I am originally from Thailand, but. I am here in the US. I'm Korean. Oh, really? Beautiful birds in the park. <laughs> you should be proud to be Thai people. I'm Thai! <laughs> <laughs> so right now we are here and I'm so excited to get another okay. Instagram picture. This so this is a dart that she was talking. She was talking about this. This freezing! <laughs> She dress up too, huh? One is a big one, it's probably the mom. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine dog. So she just say like right now it's 21. Very nice. Very nice. But it feel like 10 front. Like 10 front. Oh my god! Ten fine high. Stay with there. <laughs> He's like trying to take a picture of me. And um, up here is really cold. 
like it's super windy. So now we go to another park. Um, that's just like across the street. No, you, you need to get out it's, so far. Away. It's called Boston Common. So in 1634. My shin, I mean my my lower lip cannot move anymore. It was so bad. <sighs> bye bye Boston. So we take a quick break to the whole food. He gonna buy something to cooking tomorrow in the morning, huh? Right? Well, I guess cook. I mean, if he counts cooking eggs. Look at this, cooking. not my face. <laughs> if you count cooking eggs, then. So I don't know what he. So what are we gonna eat tomorrow morning? Uh, I was thinking cake, yogurt, cereal, fruit, you, me. Not you. No, not me. mushrooms and mozzarella and a white wine. Got stuff for ham and cheese and a masala wine sauce. So we are now at the restaurant. Actually, we make a reservation at 5, but we show up at like 5.20, almost 30. But they still got a table for us. It's so good. And I heard the food here is good too. So let's try. So, yeah, we'll see how our romantic Valentine's dinner goes. It's going well so far. So actually, I caught him like right away. He was like, in the line to pay for the roses and I was just like babe I don't need it it's like I see everything already and I think like I mean the dinner is already special for me so the roses doesn't matter anymore I tried but when you're together in Boston every second of the day it's kind of hard to surprise somebody I guess A for effort, hopefully. Are you happy? Yeah? Let's eat. So now we are finished the dinner. How was that? It was delicious. Yeah? Me or the food? Both. <laughs> yeah. So now we are going back to our house. And we're gonna go get ready for dessert and going out tonight. <laughs> so he has something to love you. But she said not I love you, but it's Valentine's Day, so I love you. Trends away. Yeah. Waiting for the trends. So cool. It's funny thing, like another thing. It was yesterday when we got off from the trends from the airport and we was like Oh well, actually today is not that cold. It's like in LA in that time, like a thank, like on Thanksgiving Day, which is like, is like this actually, like yesterday, but not today. Today is like freezing. Yeah. But right now it's like 19. Yeah. Fahrenheit. It was, it was so cold. No, it's like it's like probably 10 degrees now. It's freezing. Fahrenheit. But yeah, I, earlier today we started running just because we were so cold we couldn't walk anymore like our joints were stiff so our faces were numb Bella couldn't even move her lips anymore so yeah well we're gonna get in see you hello it's coming up so right now we are at the bar something I don't know the name 
That looks so cool. Good morning, guys. So, this is my office for today. The second day in Boston. So, I'm gonna go with the jean, and it's all blue. So, this is my sweater, jean, my belt with the red leather. This is my inside. It's really cool jean, and this is my favorite jean ever. So, because of today, it's really cold. So, I gotta wear this boot. Which is matte with all the clothes. And let's see when I put it in. Hi, good morning. You don't say anything? Good morning. How's it going? So, today we are going to the first destination that we're going is Finn Park. Is Finn Park? Wait, right? Wait. It's Wait like Park. a stadium. I don't it's know. It's the old, one of the oldest. Baseball stadiums in the country, I think. Yeah, and then might be the oldest. I don't know. I forget. So, like, as I show you guys in the beginning, like today, my outfit. Actually, I supposed to wear a jean jacket today, but it's too cold. I can't handle it. So I got a chance and wear this instead because this is so warm and keep me not to get sick. And yeah, I also bring my shoes. To change because last night I wear that boot and it was so hurt. It's painful. So I got the chance and take a picture and say, This is my outfit today. <laughs> so we're gonna walk around the stadium, see what we see, and we'll show you any cool pics. So we just like take a picture of myself right there to see it's like all my outfit today. and. I also like put on my boot. You see it? It's just so cool because I really love it. Yeah, we done today. So we will get back to you once we see some more cool locations around Fenway Park. Newbury Street, the fashion central of Boston. Yeah. And you can see a lot of different designer brands and stuff and cool hipster things. So. Really? Yeah. Are you random? They just like make it up? Or? No, look around. There's like. <laughs> Like these streets, like make me feel like I'm walking in Soho in New York. Though, like, is this like last time that we went to New York? Did we? Did we went to yeah. Soho? Soho? Yeah. Uh, what was Soho again? Okay. In New York, like. That was where there's that cafe that we ate at. What is cafe? Which one? The one in the basement. <laughs> No, but it closed too. Like we walk in this chance. Like I'm not really sure if we walk there though. Uh, but we go at night. And it's been a year. Yeah. Know. Yeah, but like. Anyways, crazy. this street is kind of like that. Actually, it's making me feel like same thing. So, guys, this is actually my favorite chocolate ever since I was in Thailand and I was in Japan like so many times and like every time when I go to the airport they're gonna have like this kind of stuff in duty free and it was so cheap if compared to here in the US so yeah thank you Bye. so this is all chocolate I just bought it's you like, like it? It's the best truffle I've ever had really? See, told you, this is like the best chocolate. All Asian people know about it. <laughs> I'm not Asian, so I didn't know about it till just now. <laughs> no. Don't feel bad if you didn't know either. What are you gonna buy? Well, we'll see, but I'm gonna wear sunglasses. So, 
today my outfit is gonna be like this. So I have one of the collared shirt, which is like oversized. Black one, high socks, belt, and the boots. So I'm gonna put them together. Actually, like if some of you guys follow me on Instagram, you're gonna see like I wear this outfit a lot. But normally I don't put the belt on. Um, I normally go with this and just you know because I live in LA, so normally I not really like dress that fashionable that much. But today I just want something new to take a picture and upload on Instagram. So yeah, let's see when I put them together. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> so you could get breakfast for me this morning. And what do we have? So today, um, our plan is going to Little Italy and Chinatown and some places that I have never been. Yeah. I'll we got a breakfast and then we gotta go. Actually one of them is gonna take us there too. Okay, the north <laughs> and Chinatown and downtown Austin. And yeah, and then we're gonna go to Tainai tonight, which is so interesting. I've never been to Tainai for like for like forever since I was in San Francisco. That was my last time. And yeah, last night was fun. Yeah. After dinner, I have like some friends come pick us up at home, and then we went to the Korean bar. Yeah. Soju bar. Delicious. It was really yeah, good. Yeah, bar. It's like a nightclub, it's but like, a restaurant. It's, it's really like in front of the Fenway Park. It's super cool. The food is delicious, and yeah. And then we went to the club, and yeah, the club was, was nice too. Actually, it's kind of same style as the first one that we went. Yeah. Right. It was this club that was off the strip of clubs that are right along Fenway Park. Uh, that's a really fun nightclub place yeah. if you want like a nightlife area. There's probably like 20 different clubs there all in a row. And it's fun to go on a Friday or Saturday night. Yeah. And there's a live band there. And $5 cover charge is pretty cheap. And the drink here is cheap too actually. Yeah. Like you couldn't find like any bar in LA that's fun and yeah. crowded and you gotta pay like eight bucks per drink. Yeah. You won't yeah. expect that at all in LA. Like, Every club here, like live entertainment and eight dollar drinks yeah. all around. So, so pretty cool. Yeah, let's get start my day and let's see where I'm going to shoot. <laughs> Why are you so pretty? No, I'm not. Oh, really? What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Is that your boyfriend? Who? This. Stop! <laughs> so here we are 
at this set. This is modeling live one on one with Bella Natip. <laughs> So what so is it again? This church in front of us is the historic church where Paul Revere went to the top and lit the lantern to display the um, warning for the country for the march of the British troops Lexington and Concord as displayed on that flag right there. It is one of the most historic churches in the whole country. Yeah? Yeah, because of that, because it marked the great warning that he gave that saved the American troops from being uh, hit by surprise by the British. What is this? A dog tag for each of the service members who died in the Iraq and Afghanistan wars. We have all the Italian restaurants and all the Italian history. Uh, and it's called the North End. Does he want to eat it? I kind of want the original. Okay, let's go. Let's then go. just go. What do you get? Um, I got the Oreo cannoli, the lemon cream cannoli, and yellow cream cannoli, sorry, and the uh, chocolate mousse cannoli. <gasps> At least you got the mousse. Yeah, I knew you liked chocolate and Oreo, so I got those What do you get? Espresso. Ew. <laughs> I'm not a big fan of coffee. Coffee, like so, we are right now in, what is that called? I don't know, I forget the name of the place. Like San Antonio? Friend, friend Telly, there's no name. Something Antonio. One of the best pizza places in Boston for New York style pizza. So that's why we came. I can't wait to eat. I'm like so hungry. <laughs> and look. Let's eat. Let's eat. So it's just my pizza. And every time I have to take the leash out. But it is. <laughs> That's good. That's a good deal. Yeah. Yeah. I tried to get it in there. Mm. So good. Mm. So right now we are in downtown crossing. Are you enjoy it? <laughs> so right now we are walking from downtown crossings and we arrive here in Chinatown. Yeah. I was gonna say downtown right now. Yeah, let's see so I'm gonna show you guys. Hi, so today my outfit is gonna be this one. It's a long sleeve Mickey Mouse shirt. And this is my long sock and my favorite skirt. This is really cute. It's denim, black denim, and it's really cute. Look, you can adjust from here. Like you can wear it like this. You can wear like this, so depend on this and my black cap. So let's put it on and explore the world. 
Good morning, guys. Today we got this car to take us out for Ross Island. Hey, yep. <laughs> that's a cool car, huh? Yeah, it'll be a fun ride, I guess. I guess. Yeah. Thank you. It's pretty cool, huh? So, good morning again, guys. So today we are having planned to go to Rawls Island by my friend's car. I'm so lucky that he offered us a car so we don't need to rent and we don't need to go like buy the public transportation because it's probably cost a lot of money and we got it free and we got the porch and this is my driver Nicholas <laughs> so yeah we're so excited this is my first first time ever in East Coast that like drive by ourselves you know like without public transportation and it's it's pretty cool yeah and today it's like one thing I realized like today is nice day it's sunny and it's probably a good for the photo too too front of the marble house so we just got done with our tour of the marble house and uh, yeah unfortunately we cannot show you any of that footage because they don't allow it for commercial purposes or non-personal use but uh, very de decadent, very elegant. It's kind of like if you've been to Europe before and you tour the castles and stuff, it's very similar. But a European influence, actually, that Vanderbilt's here, uh, married into European families. So that's kind of where it came from. But uh, yeah, if you do one of these tours, it's, it's highly worth it. Um, one thing I would say though is you probably do one of these houses and You'll be good to go. Uh, you know, like there is such a thing called museum fatigue where after you visit one and then you go to another one and then after a while you're just like, okay, I get it. These people live decadent lives that we could never amount to in any lifetime. So yeah, but it is a fun experience. And now we're going out to overlook the whole ocean, the whole bay here and walking over to the Chinese tea house. So... It's pretty. So, we tried to gain access to Fort Adams, but they're closed for the season. And even the uh, gift shop and Info Center is closed for renovations right now, so they said they're only open for privately scheduled tours. So, unfortunately, we were just able to see the uh, outside perimeter, but even that is pretty impressive. I just wish I could go inside and learn about the history. Uh, what do you think? <laughs> Nothing. So this is the menu for Anthony Seafood. It's pretty reasonable price here. Here to pay. And this is the restaurant. So it's like from when you walk inside, you're gonna see like this thing, and then you can just like pick whatever you wanna eat and go there, order there, pay there. They even have like water here that you don't need to pay for it. So now time to go. Go pay. Bella is ready to go with her lobster bib. Mm. <laughs> I 
Oh, it's going to be half a Oh, he's two. Lemon and vinegar. Daddy. You like it? So we finished like eggs, oysters, in like two minutes. And I, uh, I inhaled vinegar straight into my lungs. It was not enjoyable, don't do it. <laughs> You ready? I'll put on a tight show. You sure you can handle? We be faster than Jango. So we are here in the Capitol Mall, I guess we call it, of Rhode Island. How do you feel? <laughs> we got here a little late. And, uh,. Yeah, you can see the building behind us. It's pretty impressive. Up above, it has an inscription on it that says, apparently, the Rhode Island province became sovereign, a sovereign state on May 4th, 1776. So, for those of you who like history, anything else? No, the, the cake that we just got. Yeah. Uh, um, the chocolate mousse. Mm -hmm. It was so good. It's What's left of it is right so here. So good. It was like this, uh, they make it in a chocolate cup that you can eat. And inside of it, it has cake and topped with this wonderful cream frosting. And uh, uh, where was the place? What was the name? Yeah. <laughs> it's so good. Yeah. You can check out like on I just type on Google best pastry in Providence, Rose Island and it show us. Yeah. Like number three or four. Yeah. It's so good. Like so good. I die for it. Whoa, fancy taxi. <laughs> So messy. Oh, I just stepped on the cupcake box. The owner of the restaurant. Yeah. The owner of the restaurant, his name is Art. He's Fella's friend. And uh, he's the one that owns the Porsche we drove today. And so, yeah, he treated us. He gave us these custom made sushi rolls that aren't on the menu yet. And this one is, oh my geez, it's delicious. It's like the perfect combo of smoked and avocado. Um, just melts in your mouth. Beautiful. So, yeah, and they're, they're good. It's good food here. I would say this one, the papaya salad, is so good. Like, so good. Now I'm gonna have chicken. Mm. Babe, I'm like, I'm like, I'm going to Is it too hot though? Mm. It's good. Perfect. Ha ha ha. It's like so crispy. Wow. So, this is another menu. It's called duck noodle. Let's see. It looks so good. Let me turn around. Actually, I should change like from the channel for go traveling to be like eating. You know? <laughs> I'm gonna gain weight in like one month. Well, part of traveling is eating, so you can like do both. Mmm, baby. Yeah, it's so good. <laughs> Mm, it remind me of like if you, some of you guys are Thai. It remind you of like the noodle when you are in school, like the best noodle in school that you're waiting for every Wednesday, like that. It was so good. Wow, I didn't expect like Boston is gonna treat me well like this, but it did. especially for your last day. Well, not our last day yet. Last night. Last night. Mm -hmm. 
So this is the owner of the restaurant. I <laughs> got. So he takes like he just bring this bus. Yeah. Wow. Amazing. Yeah. Do I mean, you I try? Haven't, I haven't tried it yet, but it just looks good. Okay. Oh, yeah, you see that? Like listen to this when I crunch. You hear that crunch? Perfectly caramelized. Yeah, yeah. The yeah. Brussels sprout leaves. And they break it up so it's not like the Brussels sprout pods, but actually just all leaves, you know? Wow. That's good. It just dissolves in your mouth. Tastes <laughs> that sweet caramelized Brussels sprout with the garlic. <laughs> good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Today is Tuesday. And our last day. yeah, our last day and it's raining. So we cannot do many things. And also like my outfit today, I didn't show you guys because it's my last day and I don't have any outfit left. So look, I put like them all together and use my friend's belt doing like this because my wish is too small. So now we are walking to get food. We probably gonna get Thai food because I want Thai food. I love Thai food. <laughs> I can eat Thai food like every day. And yeah, it is pretty much all. Last night we were passed out. Like after we came back and I just like die. I cannot do anything anymore. And just sleep in his arm during his do some computer stuff. And I just like <laughs> fall asleep. And yeah, I'm so excited to go back to LA. <laughs> <laughs> no more rain and snow. Oh, it's supposed to snow this afternoon, apparently. Yeah. Let's see if it snows. You guys are gonna see the snow here. My first snow in this year. Yeah. 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 Oh. Look. She's coming here. So we have our last day, guys. And this is my favorite. So this is like the, the Thai street noodle. But I got the rice because I want to eat rice today. That's why we got rice. And like after this, her friend's gonna come. And then we are... Oh yeah, that is the name of the restaurant. Really? Yeah. Okay, so Dag in Thailand actually is it's like, it's me eat. But in, like, it's like in the bad way. Yeah, it's like, dude, and say that thing. It's not. It's not really appropriate. And except like your friend. That is a food. Looks so good. Yes. Yeah, so after this, we're gonna go head over to the Harvard or maybe somewhere else, some cafe to sit and get a dessert. Yeah, and it's really cheap too. So yeah. Look at their store closing. I got like all the cosmetic right here. It's like here. all. Ooh, all. Woo, woo, woo. And all of everything. I'm gonna show you guys all the, all the items that I bought. And you just so like the, not even 300. You have like, you guys are about to do uh, 60 items. No, this is like 200. <laughs> is this so I went to the store at a closing. And then look at all the stuff that I bought. <laughs> Wait, let me close this. Like, I don't even know how many items that I got. <laughs> but it is so cheap. It's like, wow, I can use it for the whole thing. I need to buy it for my makeup. Yeah, you can use this for your whole life. <laughs> this is all stuff here. Bye! Yeah. Oh, that way! So right now we 
a walking through Hogwarts. This is my first time too. And let's go check it out. Actually, today is not a really good day because I have it raining outside. So let's see. Okay, we're gonna survive and make the flight. We had a flight at, but actually we have at 7.05, but the plan is delayed, maybe because of the rain. And also I heard that today gonna have a snow that might be cause the delay thing. But yeah, so right now we have a little bit time to check it out at Howard, which is like two stops from my place that I stay. So yeah. Yeah. Actually, we're supposed to be here like in this morning, but we found out like they have a really good deal at Rite Aid, which is like, yeah, so they sell like a lot, like 70%. 75% off everything. Yeah, yesterday, actually yesterday my friend would say they have like 50% off, which I already like, oh yeah, I want to go. But when I got there, it's 70% off. And next week it's gonna be 90% off, which like we're not gonna be here though. But yeah, let's see what we're gonna see in Howard. University and uh, we just checked out the student center behind me and it's pretty cool like get to see I guess what you get for the priciest tuition in the country and one of the nicest colleges in the country so um, yeah next we're headed across campus to the gift shop but for now we uh, just walked across the whole campus and uh, yeah, there's a lot of history here. One of the oldest universities in the country. So uh, we'll see what we see next. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So now we're gonna go to the the store, mm -hmm. the bookstore or something. We're gonna buy the sticker that like he collect mm -hmm. all of the stickers for um, every place that we go. So yeah, now it is But it kind of sucks because it's raining today, so mm, we'll see. How yeah, and also like one thing about here, I would say is like, oh, Howard student, they look so good. They look like they have <laughs> money, not like me. I'm like, came from middle of nowhere. Uh, and this girl right here, she actually comes onto this campus to poach guys <laughs> and start dating them. That's her master plan. So it hasn't worked out so far, but we'll see if well, it's the next out. guy works. It's for two years. Uh, it, worked, it worked for two years. <laughs> establishment that you will only find in Massachusetts. Kind of a, yeah. I got like frozen yogurt all done. And and the mango and mango and apple. So we are at the airport. We just check in. And then now we have to walk to the gate that we got. Is B5 that way. So I'm on it right now, but right now the problem is all the luggage is full, so they cannot fit. And me and Nick we separate seat because we bought like the cheapest ticket. So he sit in the front and I sit in the back, which is like still have to see if it's gonna have like someone sit here or not. Yay! So finally we got a spit. We got a seat next to each other. Just over to us. 
So I'll see you in LA for real. Bye bye.